Right, we're back again. Another video today. MK Don's first Harrogate Town. Um, kick off at three o'clock. Um, we need to get a win today. We've not won in the last four league games. I've only got the win against Oxford, but that's only in the Pizza Cup. Um, yeah, we need to. There needs to be changes to the team. I don't think he's going to change it personally. I think we've got the same team that drew to Sutton. But we need to change the play style. No more long balls. We need to have possession based football. We're playing a team that. Is 18th, I think they're on, we're 11th, but I know we drew Sutton who put on the table, we, we, we should be winning this. Um, I'm going to go 2-1, I think Isa and Gilby will score, but obviously when the lineups come out we'll do a bit of a review. Uh, what are you thinking on today's game? I think it's a 1-1 one, one draw if I'm honest, I don't think we've got any quality at the moment and I don't think we're going to change. And Harrogate are going to be wanting to get out of that bottom relegation fight, so they're going to come at us and we're not going to be able to deal with it, so draw, that's it. Cool. Yeah, we're on the way now. Um, Ryan's going to meet us there. John's been there for a while doing some fan cams. So, next thing you'll see on the video is his fan cams. Enjoy. So, so uh, good afternoon. I'm John Bullard from MK Fellas. I'm at Stadium MK for the League Two clash with Harrogate Town. And today I have got a fan cam with an MK Don's legend, David Lodge. So, afternoon. Afternoon, David. It's good to have you on uh, MK Feathers' YouTube channel. Good to be here today. So, how are you feeling today? I'm feeling all right. I'm hopefully, very optimistic about our win today. We need to get back onto good form and get some free points today. And we got a goal scorer on the goal line. I would say probably it'd be a tight game. One nil, Isa. Yeah, I completely agree with you. Actually, this is my pre-match prediction. That I think it's going to be a scrappy game. Moe is going to get a goal. And um, today, um, do we see any uh, problems from Harrogate? Do you see anything? Um... To be honest, I can't really see much of the part of the league below us. So, but you never know. We said that about Stockport, they were below us. And look what happened. So, Crew we Alexander two halves. Well. Mm -hmm. So, anything could happen, but hopefully, it should be a bit of an easy win for us today. Yeah. And what's your feelings about Graham Alexander at this moment? What do you think he needs um, to do today? I think he needs to do something today. Obviously, results have not been our way. He should have got something at, at, <clears throat> at least against Sutton. Um, but he needs to do something, and the formation needs to sort of switch up a bit, I think. Mm -hmm. uh, and, uh, but yeah, hopefully he'll get his three, uh, <clears throat> three points that he needs today and roll on to a back to back victory against <laughs> Walsall Tuesday. Are you coming, Walsall? I'll oh, see you there, dude. Thank yeah, you, David. Yeah, no worries. <laughs> so, um, you, David. I am John for MK Fellas. Chris and Ryan, over to you. Right, lineups are out. Um, same lineup as last week. Harvey's in for Lewington. Um, Lewington's not on the bench, so Lunga's on the bench in place of Harvey. He's now starting for Lewington. Um, I think it's definitely a better back three. We can have some recovery pace in Harvey, um, but it's good to see him go with the same team that played all right last week. Give them obviously a chance to gen that together as well. Um, I still think it'll be 2 1. I reckon Armstrong's definitely going to score after our transfer fiasco with him and Wrexham. Um, but yeah, Issa and Gilby to score 2 1 to the Dons. Come on, you Dons.
I want to know the space map. If only yeah. they could make it like we, so short. I don't get why we're in the middle of the goal again. It's not. Back to Harvey. Come on, Harvey. Have a shot. So, so I'm John Bullard from MK7. Just screw the introduction, mate, right? So you're the best half time you've ever watched in your life, right? Amount of chances we've had, Ice has had two save, Tomlinson's hit the post, Harvey's hit the post. That own goal is not Graham's fault. People calling for his head. We've had more of the ball, we've had more shots, more shots on goal, more chances created, more corners created. This isn't his fault. If we don't go out and win the second half, then something has to change. But that own goal, camera up, it's not Alexander's fault. And if you're calling for his head after this, I'm sorry, you're deluded. Block 11 has been so quiet. What chanting have we done? Get behind your team. I've not heard us more than three times. Can't hear you over here. Can't hear you over there. Ryan, any comments? Do you think we need to start backing the team instead of fucking booing? Every time we have a little bit of shit play, we start booing our team. Start backing your team instead of booing it. We're meant to be fans, not against each other. Start working and supporting your team instead of going against them. Yes, uh, I'm John Blood, this is Ryan Wilshire. Chris and Josh have gone back now, so a half-time review. It's MK Dons nil, Harrogate Town 1, as we get the second shot. Um, that's Peg McGill Road trying to clear it, hit Warner Hoare and it's going to be net for 1-0. It's quite symbolic, but in the, the day we should really get behind him. I've also spoken with Chris Lanketty and hopefully he's going to third man at the top. Alright, I'm John Bullard from MK Fellas. Over to you. Thank you.
Yes. He's open! They've blocked so many. Don't tell me Jack Tucker just kicked that, thank you. Break his ankles! What a This is Don's action. He's doing this. Full this. All the hostility. Don's action leads. 